man. It was here it began. The streets unto Golgotha where he hanged. They hammed him unto death, yet they sang. Yet they never believed that small boy from a manger was a beast, yeah, the Lion of Judah. So they put him in a grave place because he was raised on the third day. And he went straight down to Hades, took dominion over Satan without lifting a finger. He became a man, them. The only man among the them, man among who, them who became God's only a same God. See, the message today is the deep. message today. So keep it silent. No need to speak. I'll take you where he lives. Yeah, they pick. Just lean on me and follow my lead. Because I promise to drive you home safely. Home is heaven. And my Jesus went there with a bit of display. Call him the show boy. I remember when he was taken up. The niggas around thought it was a joke, so they said he was picking up. But as the angels came to escort him, they started picking up. They are pissed always believing him. But wait, who are you not to pick up and keep holding up? When him crucified is found on air, speaking would have been on a radio station. Your guess is as good as mine, and that's fine. But make no mistake, because it may be too late for you to write and cancel in this new page Christ has given us. For me, I choose to be a preacher of sermons. I choose to be the last man standing. I choose to preach Jesus crucified, the man with many lives, that while they thought they killed him, he came back out with one sermon in mind, the promise of the Father. The promise did come, because indeed, he went to the Father. And now the sermons we preach can be filled with more fire. Christ was the first ever sermon. And what kind of a preacher will I be if I don't allow Christ to go before me and I come second? Food for thought. But these days, it's so funny how we have many saints amongst us. They act like saints, yet they are so, so stained that you wouldn't know the difference between their souls and the graffiti wall. But now they say they have a new identity. They say they are the stars amongst us. Yet they never knew that being a star is never a guarantee to keep drinking that star lager beer. I know you love wine. Well, I have good news for you. There's a special one in the Holy Ghost, and he can make all your sorrows go away from just a drip. Know this. When it comes to Jesus, you are never too young or old to start preaching him. I tried. It worked. And I want you to try to. You can start small, like Jesus is king. They killed him. He rose. They buried him six feet. He went six feet further and took dominion over Hades. They expected him to stay dead. He came back out, did a suspension, and reminded them that he was a king. They were lonely. He sent them the promise. This could be your ascension. This could be your second sermon. Monday.